What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Abby the guy here. Today I'm with my director and what are we doing director? We're reviewing Resident Evil G Fuel Cans Nemesis T flavor. Yeah. Look at that. Look at Nemesis. Focus. Focus. The whole packaging looks nice. Look at this. One thing I didn't like though, my can came with a huge dent. Look at this. All the cans we ordered had a big dent in them, right? Yeah, mine does too. Hold on, hold on. There's another dent. I think the other ones, the other two that we got in the pack had a Yeah, they, they all got dents. Like they got dropped or something. Probably did. Yeah, it looks nice though. Look, limited edition. Alright guys, this is actually, I didn't even say the flavor. The flavor is... It's tea flavor, right? Yeah, I think so somewhere I saw online that it was like half iced tea, half lemonade, like an Almer, Al Arnold Palmer. Um, guys, this has a uh, zero calories and zero sugars. Zero sugars, right? And the only thing I, I guess it could be a downside or a bad I don't, uh, or a good thing, depending on you, has 300 milligrams of caffeine. Look at that. See that? Focus. I don't know if you see it, but 300 milligrams of caffeine. We're about to try this. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. All, all right. Their cans have so much caffeine in it, though. Yeah, all their cans have a lot of caffeine. It's like it's double the amount, like in a, in a tub. All right, let's get ready. I'm, I'm not a tea person to be honest with you, so I don't know. I don't know. Who knows? You, you like it, right? It does smell good. Ready? Yeah, tastes tastes unique, right? Mm. I taste more of the more of the iced tea and the lemonade, though. I don't know about you. I agree. What I do agree. You think about it. It tastes more like iced tea than lemonade. It, you said it's half iced tea, half lemonade, right? I think I saw something like that. That's what yeah. supposed to be online, but I'm not positive. It's called Nemesis Tea Flavor. Uh, oh, it's it's since I don't know if I mentioned this. It's inspired by Resident Evil Three, which I will eventually get. I like it. I like it. What do, what do you think? I think I would recommend trying it. I mean, it's limited edition, so we we know it's not going to be around forever. And yeah, it's unique though, right? Yeah. You agree? Yeah, we, we we tried the version one variety pack of the cans, and honestly, this is one of the better flavors. I think kind of has a unique taste. Yeah, this is my favorite can so far, like a G Fuel. Yeah, it's it my has. One. Yeah, it has a unique taste. It's hard to it's hard to describe. Especially if you like iced tea. Yeah, if you like iced tea, you guys will love this. And it's not, and it's not like super sweet or super strong either. It's kind of like a mild tea flavor, you know? Yeah, I agree. So, actually, I would recommend you guys getting this. If you guys ever, if you guys ever on G Fuel website or you guys want to get some, I recommend you go ahead and buy you some of these. Why, 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 why they still have them? Because I, they're limited edition. Limited edition, so I'm guessing they won't be out for too long. I'm guessing probably once they sell out, they won't they won't come back. Yeah, or I don't know when they... So, guys, that's pretty much it. I recommend the flavor. What do you think? I recommend it, too. So, basically, our, our overall verdict is, yes, you should buy it. I think you should buy it. <laughs> Alright, that's it. See y'all in the next video. Make sure you subscribe. Where? Alright, peace!